Hey YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to fix this error message up at the top. The photo you upload is too small, must be at least 2,120 pixels wide and 1,192 pixels tall. Um, it's a pretty simple fix, or I'll show you in two different ways. And you get this error message if you tried to upload channel art that was just too small. So, the first and easiest way is on an iPhone, iPod, or iPad, whichever one. So what you want to do is you want to go into the App Store and wait for it to load. In the top corner, just type in Pick Shop, and there is a light version of this, so you don't have to buy anything if you don't want to. But you can get frames and stuff if uh, if you do buy it. So get the get that. I got the light version right now. I don't have the HD whatever. So once you get it, it'll look like this on your home screen. So click on it. Once it opens up, what you're going to want to do is click this little button in the corner to open an image. Then get the image from wherever you want. I have an image saved in my gallery. Click top and... Find a picture. So I'll use this one. This is okay. Once it loads, now this is really simple. You can either just save it from here and then, and then you'll be able to use it, or you can, there's a bunch of edits you can do on it. You can edit all this fish eye sharpness. I do sharpness a lot. So, I don't know, you could just do a bunch of different edits, apply, whatever, if you want to. You don't have to, so if you want to leave it just original, just click here in the corner, click on save, and then all you gotta do, I mean, you could do custom, but I just do ultra high, once you click on it, oh, I guess you have to have the paid version. So, it won't let me do it, but on Android, I'm pretty sure it's free, or you can get it for free. But you could click on that, and it'll save it in... It'll save it in high enough resolution so you can use that. Now, I'll show you the second way on the computer. It's a little harder, but it's f completely free. Um, so, I have tried to do... I've tried to, I did that off my Android phone and uploaded one of the pictures, but the problem that I had was I can't get what the part of the image that I want in there. As you can see right here, I just want my name, the Lakers logo, and the my guy dunking, which I can't do. So to fix this issue, what you can do is um, you could download this. I'll put the link in the description. This uh, photo editor on your on your computer is called GIMP, G-I-M-P, and I'll put the link in the description. It's good. I mean, it's a good editor. You can use it for almost anything. So, but once you you finish finish downloading that, what you have to do is you go to your browser and click on images go to Google images now what you want to type in here is I mean whatever color you want it doesn't really matter because you're not taking the background so I'll just do black back brown okay so let it load now what you want to do from here is click search tools go over to size and what I do is I go to larger than oh wait, wait. I go to larger than then what I did was I went down to larger than uh, 12 megapixel right there so it'll show all the images that 
they're they have a lot of pixels in them. So what you want to do is find just whatever you. I mean, it doesn't really matter the background. So you could click this one. It's six thousand four hundred ninety six by four eight four thousand eight hundred forty three. So just download one of them to your desktop. I already downloaded one right over here, down here in the corner. I don't know if you can see that. Down here in the corner, I have one downloaded. But so once you've downloaded GIMP and you have that background, and you also have the image that you want to use um, as your profile or your channel picture, what you're gonna do here is you have all that ready, so in GIMP, you're going to open the file up, open the background file. So just do file, open, it's going to bring up all your documents, wherever you have it saved. I just saved it to my desktop, it doesn't really matter where you have it saved. So I'm going to go down, let me find it first. Okay, so here it is, black background JPG. That's so when you open it, right? That's very. This is easy. Also, let it load. It's taking a little while. Just let it load. It'll load the image up on GIMP. Load your background. You want to do the background first, and then what you do from here is wherever the images that you have like that you want as your profile picture I have it down here in the corner if you can see right here or right, no sorry I have the picture right here so if I want this picture as my channel art what I'll do is I'll drag just drag it right on top of the black background or whatever color background you got and it'll show up like this small because the background you have has a higher pixel or has more pixels than this one so it'll show up small now what you gotta do is you go in the toolbox right here click on this one the scaling tool move this up back out of the way click on the scaling tool and just drag it, make it a little bigger, just a little bit, not too much, and then just click scale. Let that load. Now it's gonna look like this. It'll be a little bit bigger, and you're gonna click file. Uh oh. File, export, bring this up, save it whatever whatever you want, or save the name whatever you want. Alright, so do that, export it to your, wherever I exported it to the desktop, just click export. Uh, let it load. Why is it taking so long? Let it load. My com I don't have a good computer. Okay, there we go. So this will show up right here. Just click export. Let it load. My computer is really slow, that's why it's taking so long, but if you, you'll probably have a faster computer. Alright, so it's done. Now, let me see where this is saved to. Where is it? Oh, right here, okay. Saved all over here, so... There it is. I left it on my desktop. You can put it wherever you want. Doesn't really matter. Open up your browser again. Now let's close this. You don't need this anymore. Um, 
you can just close these open tabs. You don't need them. All right, so this is what I was trying to show you before how to do this. So as you can see, it's not very. I mean, it doesn't look very good. This is this is after, but this picture right here. This is after I already did what I'm showing you right now. So what you want to do is you want to click up the top right here on your chan on your channel page oh, on the banner. This little pencil will show up. Just do edit channel art. Now I'll bring this up. You can go over to the side over here and just click upload photos. Select the photo from your computer. Bring this little page up. Now just find the image basically. Let me find it. Where is it? See if I can search for it. <laughs> oh, here it is. Okay. That's hard to find. I got a lot of pictures on my desktop. So you click on it, click open, just let it upload the picture. Now it'll look like this. You'll be wondering why would you want it to look like that with all the black showing. You don't want that. So just click adjust crop. Adjust crop. Make this as small as you want really I guess. Now what you want to do is fit it to the picture whatever part of the picture you want. Not this part. Okay, so it'll still look like that when you click it, but just click select. It's fine. It'll save it. Right up here, as you can see, it's saving. Let it save. And save, see? And you can use that as your picture.